Hi everybody, thanks for joining us today. We are going to test the Yonix Voltric Flash Boost and this one is the 73 gram bracket so essentially that's a 6U flash boost racket we're going to be testing. Um, I always go through the racket specification before we actually get to the, to the testing part so uh, what we've got here is it says it's a slim shaft doesn't tell me if it's uh, flexible or stiff it just tells me it's slim feels quite stiff um, it's head heavy so the balance of the racket is towards the head of head of the racket as I said earlier it's a 73 gram racket with a maximum string tension recommended at 24 pounds the current UK price of the Voltric Flash Boost 5U and 6U is around the 150 160 pound mark again that is uh, accurate at the point of making this video please do check your local supplier if you're in Asia or if you're in Europe and check your prices because they vary all over the world slightly and also with time okay so in terms of the feel of the racket it feels super light as you can expect at this weight class and also it's um, it, it feels slightly stiff on usage but I really don't feel much weight towards the head I mean overall the racket doesn't weigh a lot in general anyway so there's not going to be a lot of weight in the head to feel um, so it, it feels pretty good it feels very usable very easy to maneuver um, but that's all expected and that's all down to the weight I suspect in terms of the design as I've said before I think uh, Yonex have to be uh, credited for their design with matte paint uh, this is beautifully done color combinations are excellent print is very clear um, so really well done to Yonex on that uh, take a look at this close-up video of the racket yourself and leave some comments below Okay, we're going to do a weight test now. So uh, let's let's put this racket on a scale and see how much it actually weighs. So seventy-eight point four is slightly higher than the six U uh, marker or the seventy-three grams that's recommended. You've probably seen other videos before. Um, it, basically, it is commonly thought that. Yonix measure their uh, away their rackets without the grip or without the string and that's that's what's adding this extra weight on we're only interested in the usable weight of the racket the playable weight of the racket and in that in this case scenario it comes under the 5u category at 78 grams um, it's going to be difficult to reduce that because uh, you may change the string which bring it down slightly but most people will add grips to it and other stuff which takes the weight up if anything so not down um, so 78 grams still super light in fairness okay let's do a smash test let's see how good this racket is at smashing the shuttlecock Okay, that's all done that went well now we're going to do a maneuver test which measures uh, air acceleration so the air speed of the racket Brilliant, that's all done. And now what we're gonna do is a control test which uh, would show us how good this racket is at controlling the shuttlecock.
Okay, that's all done. As ever, the, the results of these tests will be published to our website, www.bamtonracketreview.co.uk or .com. We really appreciate the support we've received so far. Please support us further. Without you, we can't continue to do this job. So go onto the website, register your interest, uh, subscribe to us also onto this YouTube channel. Uh, we really appreciate all the comments. So keep going. Thanks a lot. I'll see you on the next video.